welcome to another iteration of what it's like to be a parent in the car. I'm your host, uh, Mike, aka The Mecha Man. Uh, today is the day before Thanksgiving. I wanted to sit there and uh, try and get this out to at least go out the day of Thanksgiving. Um, I know that's kind of a holiday and usually um, most don't do uh, stuff day of holidays or day before or day after. Uh, I was a little behind on the last one. The last one took me quite a while to get out. Um, it just, I was having uh, some issues trying to figure out how to get it to, from phone to uh, computer. Uh, but when I, I went ahead and got that figured out. Um, so uh, today I'm actually in my wife's car, so it's going to be a little different angle for those watching the video. Those watching the audio should not notice very much of a difference. Um, I just wanted to give a quick reminder uh, about Thanksgiving and the holiday season to that it's about family, about getting together, and especially for those with uh, kids, to the grandparents. Um, I know for me a couple years I had to set aside my differences for the better of family needs so uh, I kind of want to give some words of wisdom about that that's something that is important uh, especially uh, for a podcast that's about family and being a parent um, so I recommend not doing any fighting no no arguments, no nothing. Uh, always to be calm, clear-headed, take a breath. If things start to get rough, things start to get heated, just take a second. You know, it's, a, it's always good to take a second. I, I am one that doesn't really practice what he preaches on this. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, I should be, personally, uh, should be going to my in-laws for Thanksgiving. Uh, don't really know what we're doing for Christmas yet, but I wanted to give, uh, a season's greetings to all, uh, and such. Um, I know Black Friday is going to be a day that has a lot of sales, a lot of stress, trying to get certain things, trying to get certain things that are on sale, uh, and being aggravated and annoyed when they're out of stock. Um, so always try to ask for, uh, I think it's a rain check, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so that way you can try and get uh, the sale another day, only because like if you ran run out of stock, especially if it's the last one in stock, which isn't really a good thing. Uh, if it's the last one in stock, it's like, oh, I want the last one, but someone else grabbed it before me, so it's like, um, I know that really sucks. That happened to us one year, uh, and we asked, hey, is there anything that you can do for us? Is there uh, something that we you can get us for being able to get this deal a different day? Uh, and they actually honored it. Um, luckily, it was something cheap. It wasn't anything grandiose or anything. Um, so there's always that option to ask. It doesn't hurt to ask when you're going out holiday shopping. Um, especially on uh, days where there's a lot of high stress. Uh, and I know for some people, because I've done it one year, where I had to plan out going from one day store to another store to another store, trying to make sure that uh, you can hit every store and try and get there as quickly as possible. It's, it is stressful, it is irritating. Uh, just make sure to go to bed early. Uh, wake up early, get some food in you before you head out. Uh, that's some word, uh, words of wisdom on that. Um, 
because I tried it and we didn't eat until about noon and we were up at 2 o'clock in the morning so I, I highly don't recommend that um, it's probably a little bit more difficult if you got kids because then it's like oh one person has to stay home or uh, one person is the one that does motorcycle um, waving his hands up in front of me uh, or so yeah it's really hard uh, especially if one person's staying home with the kids and the other one doesn't get the right item that's usually a very difficult thing to achieve or to or do um, so just be calm take a step back reflect on the situation don't get too heated uh, what's some other things that I could recommend It just seems like it's uh, doing uh, higher RPMs than it should. So, um, but yeah, uh, also relax and enjoy your time with your family. They, that's that's why you're getting together. You're not getting together to do arguments. You're not getting together to uh, hey, you owe me money. You're getting together to have family together. You don't usually get a chance to see them. If you can't get together with your family, try to get together with your friends. Uh, I know that's something that a lot of people are like, uh, and if you're, if, say, you know, a significant other or baby mama or uh, daddy mama has the kid for that holiday and you're feeling down, ask to join, uh, if that is possible, or ask some friends, hey, you know, this person has, you know, so-and-so, do you mind if I'm able to come over because otherwise I'm just going to be alone and... That, that way you're not alone on the holiday season. Um, sorry, I just have uh, some sinuses that's uh, <coughs> kind of clogging in. Um, but yeah, uh, it's for family, it's for friends, it's for loved ones. Uh, if you got, um, if there's no one that you could go to for the holiday season at least call. Call a friend, call a family member, because it may sound weird, it may sound dumb, but you'll appreciate it. As the sun sets, I feel like that's a good point to end it. Um, this is a short one. Hope you guys enjoy. Have a wonderful holiday season. I might, well, I might try to get one out before Christmas, but who knows? Uh, so stay tuned. Um, I, I'm gonna try and come up with topics and stuff to uh, help fill out my drive home. Um, now that I know how to get it from my phone to the computer, I will be able to do that more easily and probably more frequently. Stay safe, enjoy, drive safe. Uh, no drinking and driving. Tell your kids you love them. Tell your parents you love them. Tell your friends and family that you love them. And have a good one.